Hello friends, welcome to the world of maths by Amir. In this learning concept video, I got a question from my inbox. I would say, please read the question, try to solve question. The question is in front of you. In a triangle ABC, CVNs AD, BE and CF intersect at point P. We have four different areas given and we need to find the area of triangle. And there's one request, please try to use MPG in this question. Okay, so I hope you read the question. I would say pause the video and solve the question. And please try to use MPG concept in this okay i hope you have solved the question or at least read the question in this question i'm going to use two concepts one is the mpg and second one is the area base ratio first check what is the area base ratio if we have any triangle say abc if you have any triangle say abc and if we have a line which divides triangle in two equal parts with some base so what the area base ratio states that if our area is 40 is to 20 it means our base should be 4 is to 2 or 2 is to 1 this is the area base ratio or we can say if we have a triangle say abc and we have a lines called like this if this area is 30 this area is 10 so we can say the area is nothing but 3 is to 1 I hope this one is clear. Now, if I say take the point D, BD is 5, DC is 2. So, we can say BC is nothing but 7. And we know for the base 5, the area is 40. That means nothing but the 8 times. So, the four base 7, our area should be 8 times. That is nothing but 56. So, the area of triangle is 56. I am again repeating. We have base BD and base BC. Base BC is the complete area ABC. For the base BD, the complete area is nothing but 40. For base BD, the base is 5, area is 40. So for the base BC, the complete triangle is 7. The area should be what? Divided by 5 for the base 1 into 7. That is nothing but 56. So I am going to use this and the MPG. Okay. Now check our solution. First of all, we have to draw triangle ABC with all CVNs and all areas. So this is my first CVN. This is my second CVN. This is my third savings. Now I have to name them and give the values. Say this one is A, B, C, C, V, and D, A, D, B, E, and C, F. Now the areas given are nothing but 40, 30, 35. Though in this question, 84 is not required, but I am writing 84. Okay. Now we have to find the base ratio if we have area. Since we know this point is P. In P, A, B, the area is 40 and 30. So, we can say the base ratio is nothing but 4 is to 3 in triangle P, A, B. I hope this is clear. In triangle A, B, D, our base are nothing but A, P and P, D. For the P, D base area is 35. For the A, P base area is 70. So, we can say the base ratio is nothing but 2 is to 1. Now, use M, P, G at point A. This one is 3 and 1. So, we can say this one is nothing but 3. 3, 2, 6. That should be 6. 3, 4, 12, this should be 4. That is 4, 2, the summation should be 6, so this should be 2. So, we can say the ratio is nothing but 2 is to 1. Now, we have to find the area of triangle ABC. We know for the ABC, the total, sorry, that is 2 is to 4. For the ABC, the total base is 6. We need to find the area. Here, we know the BD is 2. The BD is 2. The BD, the total area is nothing but 105. For the 6, we can say 105 divided by 2 into 6 that is nothing but 3 the area is 315 square meter or square unit for this one i hope this one is clear i hope this one is clear so as per request i use the mpg in this concept but sometimes we use mpg with the other ratios so i use area ratio in the base format okay i hope this one is clear but still if you have any doubt i would say rewind the video watch it again you want to discuss something my facebook is always open for you please ping me Thank you and happy learning.